a restless night. Then Jesus went with his disciples to a place called Gethsemane. And he said to them, sit, sit here while I go over there and pray. Uh, he took Peter and, and, and the two sons of Zebedee. Uh, the Bible didn't tell you right now, but the two sons of Zebedee were James and John along with him. And he began to be sorrowful and troubled. This is what the Bible says. He was, he was in, in sorrow and trouble. Verse 38 says, then he said to them, my soul is overwhelmed with sorrow to the point of death. Stay here and keep watch with me. Going a little further, he fell with his face to the ground and prayed, my father, if it's possible, may this cup be taken from me. Yet not as I will, but as you will. I, I wanna talk about a restless night uh, I was looking up in the dictionary, uh, a restless night. The definition was when you struggle to fall asleep or, or, or toss and turn in the night and, and wake from sleep often and generally do not feel rested. That's what a restless night is. You, you're not feeling like you got enough rest. Well, have, have you ever been in a position where, where your spirit is willing to do God's will, but your flesh knows that you're going to feel the pain in the morning. I, I don't know how to make this thing. This, this thing ain't going to feel too good. I, I can stretch all I want and it's not going to feel good. And, and you are going to have some restless nights. I'm telling you for the cause. For whatever the responsibility is, sometimes you're going to have a restless night. Jesus went to pray to God. He went to him a second time and, and asked the same thing. And, and, and he was like, can you take this cup from me? If it be your will, can, can you take this cup from me? And, and I can imagine God didn't answer because in his mind he was already saying, didn't we already discuss this? This is the only way that this can happen. I can imagine in, in, in Jesus' mind him saying, I don't know if I'm ready for this. That A restless night, that's where it started. It started with this restless night. We all, I'm going to tell you the truth, we all should have us a, a restless night sometimes. Everybody has has this responsibility over their life, but sometimes we're going to go through the night worrying about what we have to do. If you never had a restless night while you were trying to sleep, and you probably don't have a lot of responsibility. People, people without responsibilities sleep comfortably through the night. If you have some responsibility and God is going to have some things that are going to be on your mind about how you're going to get there. But 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 let God take care of it. <laughs> That's what I want you to know. Let God take care of your responsibility. If he brought you to it, then, then God will bring you through it just like he did for Jesus.